The thing is, and I watched this the other night, really enjoyed it, um, it's not mean in any way, it's really constructive. No, I mean, you know, everybody thought I would go on because I love neutrals, I would only choose things that I loved, but I'm going there very neutral and I'm looking for talent. And it's so hard for these young sort of amateur designers. They've never met the homeowners. They've got a thousand pounds to spend. They've got a day to do it in. They turn up, they've got camera crews and they've got us breathing down their necks. And they're really bold and courageous. Mm. The toughest bit for you, I imagine, is because you, it must be so obvious for you when you walk in a room, what needs to be done. Yeah. So it must be difficult for you to almost hold back. Well, we have to. That, that's the worst thing for me, is I want to go in and say, no, 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 do it like this or take this Must away. Drive or drive you mad. It drives me insane. I go off and have a coffee and I'm pulling my hair out. And then I sort of go in and I try and sort of drop little hints to try and help them. And you know, when you do your own home, making decisions, what do you do? And For me, the budget, I don't know how they do it. Mm. I mean, it's extraordinary. Do people invite you round for dinner? Well, I'm I mean, still we've waiting. Known, yeah, we've known, my, yeah. I've been to yours. Been I love yeah. your home. We've, been, we've known each other a long time. <laughs> I've been round to your beautiful home, which Thank is quite you. incredible. Um, but you do get terrified about uh, about inviting Kelly Hoppen over for dinner. Well, I mean, she I walks in got... and goes, oh. No, but I don't. That's the thing. You know, all I'm waiting for is the tequila or the vodka. Do you know what I mean? That, that I'm, That's my focus. <laughs> plenty go of that. Out. <laughs> There's plenty of that. But it's like you kind of switch off. You can't. And... If somebody turns around to me, I remember once going to somebody's home and, and I sort of looked around, scanned the room because I can't help it, and they then turned around and said, you know, I'm a great fan, and I could see bits of my books in the room, and they said, would you change anything? And I said, would, would you like me to? And they said, yes. And within a second, I could move things an inch or a little bit and put it right, but if they hadn't asked... Then you I would have, have done just it. But would you have got evening. in the car on the way home and gone, oh, my God, did you see that sofa? No. No? No, I because, bet you do. no, but I don't. I can't explain. I promise, promise, promise I don't, because otherwise my brain would always be full yeah. of, of that. And okay, so have we give you free permission then. Have a look around our studio. Um, is there anything that you would change? Well, you know, be honest, we no, don't because mind. TV is different. You need boldness. Everyone knows I love neutrals. I adore neutrals. But I have to say, with this show, it has, you know, Dan has really pushed me a lot more to be putting more colour in. I mean, for me, I probably wouldn't have a blue sofa. Yeah. I would have a neutral it's an appetite sofa. Suppressant. Yeah, otherwise we'll uh, eat yeah. everything. Stops us from but eating. Because you have people sitting on the sofa and you're showing different things the whole time, yeah. to have a neutral backdrop, I think, is great. But actually, when I walked in here today, I was so excited. And then I sort of thought, oh, it's really happy. So I think it just depends on who you are. And we do. So, is there any? Would you change any accent? Because any of our accessories? Oh, are they I mean, I could have come in here and changed the whole thing. Yeah. You did. <laughs> I mean, I did already next door. Should we have a look? Paper. Should we have a look at what you've done? So this is in our sort of green room. Oh, wait, I didn't even recognise the room. So we put the palm tree in, which is a really big thing at the moment. Right. And then I sort of went and nicked a few things from there and changed the accessories a bit. It looks lovely in there. And that sort of rose gold colour, the kind of rosy and the brasses and things like that, that's very big it's for this very season. big, all these accent metal colours, and the high street is full of them, and it's really, really good well, because... Go on. No, because you can add a little bit of that kind of zhuzh to your home but you know design is all about layering of textures why are you laughing no i'm just thinking that how what a painful task we set you because we said you know can you have a look online and see whether or not there's any cushions or anything that you can put on our sofa which we just found out you don't like the color and no, no, I didn't, uh, I didn't like and, and you weren't obviously allowed to pick any of your own stuff i'm not allowed to pick any of my own but the, <laughs> the high street is full of amazing things and and one of the great things at the moment and it's very kind of it's like the beverly hills um, hotel, beverly hills hotel mm. and you know it's been there for years but now everyone's bringing back in the palm trees which are really kind of retro and these cushions are great because they but I would only have one okay you see and that's the thing what people do is so they put one too the other much end. but say you had that and then you wanted to add in maybe linen you're you're you know you're creating something that is giving textures. a bit of, yeah a bit of a texture or you could put in a bit of this sort of metallic or if you wanted to have something a little bit different Older. this retro sort of prints are really good at the moment so say for example you've got kind of linen and then you wanted to add in a bit of color that's where i would add some of the color in, in an so accent as an opposed accent, to and then with over. your ceramics and things 
Or... I love this. This is great. So, say you, you've got some grey, cos that would be a better colour for your sofa, FYI. Or the grey. Yeah. <laughs> so, say you had some grey, you could then bring in something like that. Now, yeah. what people will do is they'll go out in the same way as they go and buy clothes. They see, you know, Giselle or Kate Moss dressed in something amazing. You wouldn't just order it and put it on. you try it on. So, at home, you need to do the same. So, if you've got more neutral colours at the, in the back, you can add all of these kind of accents and they look really good.